in Colorado, you can be as loud as you like. Meet Joe Lorienti, the CEO of rocket engine maker, Ursa Major. Holy <laughs> That was like a lot better than anything I've seen in a long time. It's a time. unique experience out here. <laughs> Ursa Major does its work here in a suburb of Denver, where it can fire its big, loud engines. The world today is full of rocket startups, and each one is trying to make their own rockets and their own rocket engines. But as many of them have learned, engines blow up. Okay, you just saw a bright flash there. That's what makes building rockets so hard. Ursa would like them to consider a new idea. Don't bother making engines, buy them from us. There are a few reasons companies buy engines from us. The, the most common or the easiest sale is uh, the make versus buy decision. The way that we exist allows other companies to exist. It's almost funny that it hasn't happened sooner because you're looking at companies like Pratt & Whitney or Rolls-Royce, they're making engines, Boeing's not making their own engines. That would be crazy. That's time consuming. That's the hard part, you know? If a company's just starting, they need an engine. We now have engines available. Yeah. That's almost a no-brainer. We can save them five years, tens or hundreds of millions of dollars. You know, technology overall is notoriously kind of skews male. And in my experience, aerospace companies are it's like nine to one. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Is that weird or is that changing or? There's definitely significantly more women here than I'm used to working with. Yeah. It's really nice, actually, because I don't feel like I'm like in a fishbowl or some kind of zoo animal. Yeah. <laughs>